Uh, Valentine, you've just drawn your own face over the character sheet? It said draw your hero, and I'm my own hero. Okay. And Fret, it says your starter sword does murder a thousand damage? My bad, I left off a zero. Okay, no plan! Fred and Valentine can't be trusted with pencils, let alone dice. So it is up to you, newbie. You are the fate maker. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And these fools shall be thine advisors, I guess. Fine. I advise that you better be a badass. We're here to slay evil and get gold. I know you see me as a role model. Follow my lead and you'll be a great fate maker. All right, one last thing. Bunkers and Badasses is a role-playing game, baby. That means you do not break character voice. Kapiski? Break me off a piece of that. Mmm, mmm, tasty. Now, prepare to enter a world of fantasy. Uh, I don't see anything. You gotta imagine it, knucklehead. Just close your eyes and wonder. You have arrived in the snoring valley, an unassuming and peaceful corner of the town <coughs> that harbors a dark secret. Dun, dun, dun. You journeyed far to be here, heeding the call of the queen herself. <gasps> the queen herself? What could she want of us? She fears the Dragon Lord will soon reawaken. You must find his tomb and prevent his resurrection. What I'm hearing is we get to whoop his ass. Uh, here's a little cheat sheet to track your health and map and stuff. Oh. You recognize one of the Queen's Waystones. It seems to call to you. The Queen's magic enters you through the stone, granting you the power of... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Arrah! You now have magical sight and hearing, baby. Queen Butt Stallion! She's guiding us on our quest! Sure enough, baby. A trail of spectral hoofprints leads off into the woods. Bars your path. What you gonna do about it, huh? I cast Identify Tree. It's a species called Jumpus Tutorialis, and weirdly, it only grows in this one valley. <laughs> Ahead, 
The glint of edge steel beckons you forward. Some hot lumberjane has left her axe in a stump. I love a good axe. Great for cleaving, hacking, even a good old fashioned chop chop. A cave mouse sits covered over nearby. If only you could. Though the magical hoof prints continue through the cave. The rocky ceiling dips low to the ground. A true fate maker knows when to stand tall and when to crouch. Yeah, work them sweet glutes. And if you get a running start and crouch, you'll slide around like a cool action hero. Another waystone guides your path, but reaching it will mean going through a pack of Nasty, pinchy crabs. Yeah! Combat! Kill them all! Ah, pinchy! They're so pinchy! since I was but a humble player, like you, Bing Bones. She has foreseen your arrival and left a powerful weapon for you. The weapon of a fate maker. It's a gun! But still capable of shooting skulls off necks from 20 paces. <laughs> Wait, there's guns in fantasy? You're in Tainus Fantasy, baby! The shrine floor rises beneath you. From here, you can spy a quaint little village nestled in the bodacious bosom of the valley. But beyond it, a dark and ancient castle lurks... ...lurkingly. If I was sealing away the dragon lord, it would be in an inconspicuous room, such as... a ward. That's like a magical shield above your health. Pretty sweet.
very heroic. Tina, can we blow up the rocks? Sorry, it's impossible. Without explosives! You gotta shoot him. If you... Victory! I never lost hope. Ahead, you hear the roar of raging fire and the clackety clackety of bones. We're here to save the village. Ooh, the village is already ransacked and crawling with skilly men. We're here to avenge the village. An extra powerful skeleton arises! A badass! A single villager remains alive in the carnage. But she looks bad, baby. She looks like she's about to die. Might as well save her peasant ass. The tomb is inside a crypt. The perfect hiding place. May the Queen's favor see your noble quest through. My Hendaz is killing me! The ruins of Castle Harrowfast are just out yonder. Which is fantasy for saying. It's over there, baby! Wait, wait, wait. 
I thought we already beat the Dragon Lord. When you got more than one gun, you can switch between them. Keeps combat spicy, like Jambalaya! So, Tina, maybe after this quest, I could be the Bunker Master. I've been working on a campaign. It's got orcs and kissing. Tina don't play no more, okay? But it's all good. I got mega tons of questicles simmering up in my brain sauce, baby. Clutching a dusty spell book as though awaiting a destiny that never came. Well, this place is super grim. I love it. Grab that spell book. With a spell book equipped, you can cast the frost spell to within. Ice bed is extra strong against the undead. They got none of that greasy flesh to keep them well. 
Now, how do we get into the tomb crypt? There's got to be an entrance around here somewhere. Yeah. The floorboards of the throne hall seem uh, rotten and brittle. There's no escape! down into the depths beneath the castle. It smells of old stone and all their secrets. <sighs> you hear a rumble and a booming laugh seems to come all around you. <laughs> Resurrect the Dragon Lord. That's the exact opposite of what we want. We gotta get in there. I'm not trembling. I'm trembling! Kick his ass, newbie!
damn it, he got away? We gotta track him down. I want that big bad boss kind of loot. 